although I am a lawyer by profession and by, teach, uh, by training, but I never um, went into practice. I did research because I was working in uh, the eastern part of the country, um, in Arunachal basically where there was no court, not even a bench of the high court. So I decided to go into legal anthropological research, you know, because laws jo hai, jo Delhi mein bante hai, parliament mein, wo kai bar they are not applicable to these areas. You know, so there you find local laws, customary laws. I don't know how much you have uh, heard about this, but they are more prevalent and people comply with these laws. These, these are custom based, they are social norms and sometimes they are more effective when it comes to conservation. Um, and also in agriculture we find for dispute resolution, uh, sometimes these customary practices uh, and are very effective. So I am sure aap logo ne bhi uh, apne apne jahan se aap log aaye hain. Aap ne bhi shayad observe kiya hoga. But maybe when we see this film, you will be able to connect somewhere in your a own areas. And maybe when you go back, maybe you could also go deeper into these things. Because I have seen sometimes uh, state made laws are not so effective when it comes to local people working with the local communities. It's their own customs. And if we build on that, that is more Im important and effective in uh, conservation. अब उनको समझ आ रहा है कि जा रही भाई आफ्टर ऑल इतनी सेंसिटाइजेशन प्रोग्राम्स हो रहे हैं वर्कशॉप इसका रीजन मैं बताता हूं कि बेसिक रीजन शुरू में था हम्म एक लैंड एक्ट आया था हां पहले लोग अपने नाम से जमीन इसलिए नहीं कराते थे कि टैक्स देना पड़ता हम्म साल के 6 महीने से कुछ पैसा लगता था जमीन हम्म मेरे स्टेट की बात है तो दूसरा डिफरेंस होता है इस वजह से कोई भी कोई ये डरता कि वो कोई आया पूछने की जो शुरुआत होती है अच्छा हो सकता है कि प्लेन एरिया में आ गई है आ गई है बल्कि अब तो आप इंटरव्यूज करने जाते हैं तो वो पैसे भी मांगते हैं नेपाल में जब मैंने काम किया था तो कुछ ऐसे क्षेत्र थे जहाँ पे बहुत रिसर्च जाते थे तो वो दे स्टार्टेड आस्किंग फॉर मनी कि टू ट्रेनिंग करने के लिए गाँव में जाते हैं तो वहाँ पर पहले भी यही देखते हैं जैसे डॉक्टर साहब बोल रहे हैं की क्या लेके आए क्या मिलने वाला है और इन केस सपोज सेम विलेज में एक बार ट्रेनिंग पहले हम कर चुके हैं और उस टाइम में पैसा नहीं दिया है वहां पर तो नेक्स्ट टाइम होने नहीं देंगे सही बात है ट्रेनिंग व्हाट वर ट्रेनिंग या एक्सटेंड अदर एक्सटेंशन प्रोग्राम या फ्रंट लाइन डेमोस्ट्रेशन या ऑन फार्म ट्रायल जो भी प्रोग्राम हम लोग करते हैं तो नहीं पड़ेगा लोगों का जब तक आप में वो नहीं होगा कॉन्फिडेंस तो वो नहीं शेयर करेंगे पर ये है वही मैं कह रही हूँ ना तो बदलाव आया है क्योंकि आप लोग की जो ट्रेनिंग हो रही है इसका मतलब उसका कुछ अवेयरनेस जनरेट हुई है गाँव में विच इज गुड और स्पेशली हमारे स्टेट में क्या है नागालैंड में कि वहाँ पर जो भी एग्री एंड एल डिपार्टमेंट या सपोज आत्मा या नबार्ड फाइनेंस फाइनेंस करते हैं तो वो लोग जब ट्रेनिंग या अदर प्रोग्राम इम्पार्ट करते हैं तो इंडिविजुअल पर्सन को पैसा देते हैं फाइव हंड्रेड रुपीज टू हंड्रेड रुपीज तो वो लोग जब ट्रेनिंग करते हैं तो पैसा दे देते हैं और हम लोग जब अपनी अपनी टेक्नोलॉजी जो असिस्टमेंट करते हैं रिफाइनमेंट करते हैं उधर में इंट्रोड्यूस करने के लिए इंटरनेशनल के लिए जाते हैं वो लोग पैसा नहीं देने से टेक्नोलॉजी भी अडॉप्ट नहीं कर सकते और सीड्स भी जो लेते हैं इवन क्रिकेट सीड हो या वाट एवर टेक्नोलॉजी हो लोग उसको नहीं एक्सेप्ट हाँ वो तो हमारा भी एक्सपीरियंस रहा इसी जगह पे जहाँ पे मैंने काम किया था मेरी अब एक्चुअली पी रिसर्च यहीं पर हुई थी 
تو وہاں بھی یہی تھا کہ یہ جو ایکسٹینشن سے جو آتی ہیں سیڈس تو وہ نہیں ایکسیپٹ کرتے ہیں اروناچل میں بھی میں نے کام کیا تو وہ تو یا تو اگر دھان کا ہے تو کھا کے پکا کے ختم کر دیتے ہیں یا پھر مارکیٹ میں بیچ دیتے ہیں اگر کہیں بھی ایک تو پتہ اس کا ایک اور ریزن کیا ہے جو میرا ایکسپیرینس ہے کہ کیوں یہ اپنے سیٹس پہ کیوں اتنا ریلائی کرتے ہیں اور باہر کے کیونکہ کیا ہوتا ہے اگر جو تھوڑے بہت کسان کوئی ایکسیپٹ بھی کر لیتے ہیں نئی سیٹس اور کوشش کرتے ہیں اس کو اس پہ اگر کوئی کیڑا لگ جاتا ہے تو اس سمے ان کو کوئی نہیں ملتا ہے جو بتائے گا کہ اس کو کیسے ٹھیک کرنا ہے ویئر ایز جو ان کا اپنا سیڈ ہوتا ہے دے نو ہاؤ ٹو ڈیل ود اٹ اس پہ کوئی پرابلم ہو تو دے ہیو دیٹ انف وزڈم ٹو ڈیل ود اٹ بٹ وین دیز نیو تھنگز آر انٹروڈیوسڈ وہ صرف اتنا ہی ہوتا ہے کہ آپ ان تک دے دیجیے پر اس کے آگے وہ نہیں کچھ کر پاتے ہیں ہاں وہ تو اس میں بھی آپ نے دیکھا بھی ہاں جی بالکل اس سے ڈرائی رہتا ہے بالکل تو میرا کہنے کا مطلب یہی ہے کہ دیکھیے دیر از اے لاٹ آف نالج دیئر ہم لوگ بھی جاتے ہیں کچھ نالج لے کے تو یو نو دا ایکسٹینشن شوڈ ناٹ بی ون وے ہمارا یہاں کیا ہے چاہے کوئی بھی آپ ایگریکلچر لو اریگیشن لو کوئی بھی ڈپارٹمنٹ لے لو یا لا لے لو اٹ از آلویز اے ٹاپ ڈاؤن اپروچ کہ وی ول اونلی تھنک آف ایکسٹینڈنگ تھنگس ٹو دیم یو نو ٹو دیٹ لیول ٹو دا ولیج لیول بٹ وی نیور تھنک اباؤٹ ٹیکنگ یو نو تو اگر آپ سیکھ بھی لیتے ہیں تو اٹس اونلی یہ جو اتنے ایکسپیرینسز آپ کے پاس بہت ہوں گے اپنے اپنی جگہوں سے کہیں زیادہ ہوں گے کیونکہ کچھ کمیونٹیز اور کچھ ولیجز اب کافی بدل چکے ہیں جیسے آپ نے بتایا پر ابھی بھی آپ ہمالیہ میں کیونکہ میرا کام زیادہ ہمالیہ میں ہی ہوا ہے آپ ہمالیہ میں جائیں ابھی بھی ریموٹ ایریاز میں یہ چیزیں ہیں جو میں بتا رہی ہوں اور آپ بھی آپ یو آر کنفرمنگ دیز تھنگس ناگا لینڈ میں ہاں جی جی اچھا 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 جی تو آپ نے بہت انفارمیشن اور نالج گین کی ہے پر یہ مجھے نہیں لگتا آپ نے اور جو پالیسی میکرز سے یہ کبھی شیئر کی ہوگی بیکاز دیز آر تھنگس وی جسٹ کیپ ٹو ابھی آپ ہی نے کہا جینتی جی نے کہا کہ وی نو آ لاٹ آف دس پر وی نیور تھنک اباؤٹ اٹ ہم اس کو ویلیو نہیں کر کے آگے نہیں بتاتے ہیں تو دس انفارمیشن شوڈ ریچ دا پالیسی میں میکرز آلسو بھائی ٹیکنالوجی کئی بار کیوں اڈاپٹ نہیں ہوتی ہے ہو سکتا ہے وہ اس ان کے کام کی نہ ہو اگر کام کی چیز ہوتی ہے تو فارمر کو پتہ ہے اس کے کام کا کیا ہے وہ امیڈیٹلی اڈاپٹ کرتا ہے تو ایسا بالکل بالکل تو یہ تو آپ لوگوں کا پھر ایک کام میں ٹی او آرز میں ایڈ ہونا آنا چاہیے کہ آپ اپنے اپنے ایریا سے نہیں وہی میں بول رہی تو وہاں جہاں پہ ان کو اپنا فائدہ دکھے گا دے ول ایکسپٹ اٹ آپ جو نئی ٹیکنالوجیز ہاں وہی تو وہ تو آپ فارمر ہیں اس لیے اچھا 
माई गॉड ये भी जो ट्रेडिशनल वराइटीज है वो भी इवॉल्व करती है और जरूरत के हिसाब से ही वो चेंज भी होती है अब बस आखिरी में the secretary of biodiversity authority is going to be here on 27th <laughs> you can talk to him about yeah. that all the yeah. problems even when we studied in colleagues right in tamil nadu yeah in different pockets what i have observed is when we there was when development comes it is having a negative impact so where the villages were very rural and there is no uh, facility of road and other things the traditional knowledge is more preserved yeah yeah when everything becomes uh, accessible then they also want to come to the see there are many reasons that and also the younger generation leaves the uh, rural so areas come to the cities lost. yeah so but as a scientist we know there is a lot of value yes. so somewhere we have to find solutions or ways to preserve some of these also because i don't think everything can be kept in your gene banks here so whatever is there in the farmers all that that has happened is Biodiversity registers. Registers, registers, yes. But after that, it's not. Registered. No, that's what I was saying. That the register should not be just left as registers. We should go to the next level, where scientists should actually benefit. I mean, both should benefit, but it saves the time and resource resources of the government also. See, ICR resources are government public money. If we use farmers' knowledge as the base and make them partners in our research, then that will help in saving the resources of the government. it will help farmers knowledge also get recognition which is not getting so that's why they are stopping you know they have stopped growing things if you go to my part of the hill you'll find the fields are all barren of course with other reasons because there's a lot of um, wild animal depredation also but then younger generation has left and then uh, there is no uh, recognition so that's why i feel um, there should be first definitely i am not saying that you should there should live like that but that knowledge is something we need for our future for industrial growth for the growth of our country like yeah. you said to dekhiye fir kitni achhi baat hai aaya hai farmers ko graduation ki degree de raha hai acha very nice i am a farmers professor acha very good i didn't know about that aap se baat karenge traditional knowledge se hi hai bas wohi hai ki likhne aur bolne ka dhang alag hai haan ji नहीं अच्छा है मुझे तो लगता है इसका बहुत यूज है एंड नॉट ओनली द कम लोकल पीपल बट द कंट्री विल बेनिफिट फ्रॉम इट अच्छा 
But we, what we in India do, we doing it in peace thing. Mm. Try to take it digital India. Mm. We said that it will be weakened. Mm. But it is a one program. Why don't yeah. somebody plant it in a holistic way? So I agree with you. It is a complete village thing. Right? The mm. village requires a planning. You talking about the basically giving them the uh, facilities of bathroom and all those. Mm. So why don't we plan in a way so that it can come like that only? Bilkul. We are not doing that one si. and not using the ecosystem which is prevalent there, keeping that thing into view and making it and then and nobody well, suggesting a model of it. That's a, you know one of the main reasons why this is not happening because you know firstly there is no convergence amongst these various schemes of government of India or even the state government. Like you said, bathroom koi or banata hai, pani koi or deta hai. You know, so there are different departments. We deal with different things, and there's no convergence amongst them. वो क्यों नहीं है? भाई आपको सोचना नहीं नहीं वो तो आपको सोचना पड़ेगा वो क्यों तैयार नहीं है? बिल्कुल बिल्कुल Imagine the plight of the farmers, what is there. Mm. So that thing we have to keep it, bring them up. Mm. Like we talk about, like we all say, we, we went for an experiment there, demo and all that. Mm. But demo, we have got our own purpose. We are not able to connect with them. Mm. That connection is required. Very much. So that is what we require. But like everybody has to think over it, why he is running away. Why he is not interested into it. When you have done so much of hard work. Next so lecture should be by him. <laughs> Monday morning first lecture will be from <laughs> you. No, that's what I'm saying. That's why I said it's important that we should talk about these things because somewhere, as again Jayanti ji when I met her, she said, "Hum logo sab pata hai, jo hum logo wahan se aate hain field se, we know it, but we don't value it. Hum ye nahi usko aage nahi le jana chahte hain. We don't recognize it. So that is most important. So Monday's lecture um, has been finalized. Yes. Whether the farmer needs it or not. Yeah. So that so should be. Going and imposing some people. They came with the tulip. Uh, Eighteen o'clock. No. Yeah. Without, uh, they have just constructed some toilets. Toilets. So they use them as storage rooms. Yeah. Even houses. So so I just came back. I also. I, I also. Not, not asking, not imposing it. I manage the small grants program of Jeff, and uh, this is the global environment facility. And um, one of our partners was in Mysore, near Mysore, you know, the Bilgiri Rangan Hills, that side. I just came back last week, I was there. And uh, we had provided cook stoves, you know, the small class tulas, so that the women's health is improved and people don't go um, fuel efficient, so they don't have to get the uh, fuel wood from uh, the reserve forest or the sanctuary. I went and saw, I went on a monitoring visit because we had to send a report to our headquarters. So I said, before I see, I will not send them because I know often these things don't work. I went to the field and I found that ha half the things were just covered with other, like you said, it's, using a, it's being used as storage. So there's a chula on the side and then on top you had many other things and they were neat and clean. So I asked this uh, partner, you know, the grantee, you know, what, what has happened? Nahi, aaj cleaning ka din hai, toh sab safai karke rakha hua hai. It was neat and clean. It didn't seem as if it had been used. So now, every day, 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 every no, no, I'm sure they do it, but the way it was used, it was not used for a long time. I think it's time to wind up. I think it's time to wind up. Amarjit Ji is waiting here to wind up. So I will not go any further. You have the presentation. You have a small article also, paper. Just one last thing, you know, which we were thinking about. I don't think there are people from agricultural universities here. Yes, I do. Yes, Ajad, you have, okay. So basically, um, the idea is when we are doing research, we should look at those varieties which are at the verge of you know, extinction or they are threatened. Because if you look at the people's biodiversity registers, which uh, Mr. Mr. Rabi Kumar will come and talk to you uh, uh, next week from the biodiversity authority, 
but they are supposed to prepare these biodiversity registers. All biodiversity management committees at the local level, they have to prepare these registers where they will do documentation of all biological and genetic resources found in their area. Now, uh, it should also give you know which one is going to which is in the on the verge of extinction or threatened so that you people if you think there's potential you should work on those you know re, for reintroduction conservation etc then uh, one more thing was about you know capacity building of farmers in se seed selection and uh, seed storage etc because abhi i'll just tell you now uttarakhand government wanted to promote ragi you know the finger millets they wanted 5,000 kgs. Aapi ka ICAR ka hi lab hai, shayad Vivekanand lab, udhar Almoda ke paas mein. Haan ji. To they, they wanted, government wanted 5,000 kgs of that seed. Unko mila nahi, sirf 30 kg seed leke aaye. So then where there is a demand, then we should be working with the farmers to build their capacities to, you know, get good quality seeds also. So these are certain things which you should think, what is going to be of use how can we connect with the farmer? I think you people know it better than I do. So um, I think I will just end here. And um, thank you.